what's up youtube welcome back to my channel so as y'all can tell by the title i am going to do basically my um makeup tutorial like my this is my everyday makeup look um what inspired me to do this video was one of my girls um she's one of my friends she does not um wear makeup and she was like, you know, she want to start doing her makeup more just for like an everyday look. And, you know, when I get dressed and stuff, I like to have my makeup done. Um, I'm very beautiful without makeup. Um, I know that. My Everybody tells me I don't need it. Um, but I love makeup, so why not? Um, I like how it makes me look. And so, little background story real quick. Um, when I was like 18... I started doing my makeup and my daddy um will always tell me like record yourself you know my daddy will always tell me like i do really good with my makeup so for me um i am not a professional i don't want to be a professional this is how i do it um this is just i'm gonna the simple things that you need to do your makeup just to you want to go out to eat with your boo or you want to go out um and you don't uh, and you do not know how to do makeup this is I hopefully like I hope that it's helpful because this is how I've learned I watched pre previous videos when I was doing it like four or five years ago and this is something that has helped me so we're gonna get right into this video I'm gonna tell y'all basically what it is um I'm running kind of low on stuff so things might be kind of empty but I'm gonna go into detail and show y'all basically what to do because I just know like some people don't know what to do and this is the start so let's hop right into the video period okay so first thing first thing that i do with starting with my makeup is my eyebrows so for my girls who have eyebrows like me thick and for my girls who don't um this is how i'm gonna tell you to do your eyebrows okay because some people they don't um do them correctly it don't have to be perfect but i don't like that um look that people do um that is like the lines up here you shouldn't be having a line right here no okay so what i encourage my girls to do for my eyebrows if i can get this stuff together I take like a, I guess they call it like a spoolie. Um, I take it and I brush my eyebrow, okay? So, I brush my eyebrows just to even it all out, okay? I take a brown pencil. You can get this at Walmart for 93 cents. Just a regular pencil like this. Mine is really low. And this is what I do. It's hard to do it, do it in a camera. So, so this is what I do. I start at the bottom of my brow, like the side at the top. I start here and I go down, okay? So, and I'm doing lightly strokes, okay? So, I take it like this. Y'all, yeah, I messed up already, guys. Okay. I know y'all probably can't see and I'm lightly just bringing it down. You, hear, you know what I'm saying? So then I go at the bottom and I bring it down. Then I go in lightly inside and I'm just bringing that back down. You see how that sharp got there? Okay, so that's all I'm doing, light strokes. And I work my way up to the top a little bit. I don't go right here. So I take take my pencil and I'm just cre creating a, a line, which I'm not really creating a line because I already have a line because of my arch, the way my brows, um, I got them waxed and I'm just lightly in there. And that's all I do. And you'll see how I look after when I get done. It may not look like much, but you're not really touching your brow. You know what I'm saying? You're not creating an eyebrow. Your eyebrows already there. All you're doing is filling them in. That's all I do. So with this side as well. 
I'm starting at the bottom and I'm bringing it down, literally. I'm coming here, I'm starting at the bottom. I'm bringing it down. You get what I'm saying? Like that. Bringing it down, coming to the top, just a little line. And as you can see, I'm barely touching with the pencil. With the pencil, I am barely touching. Okay. And you may get like a little line. See, like this is a no no. You don't want that to stay. I sometimes just clean it up like that, just smudge it on in. Okay. Then I then take this, the brush, and I'm just brushing it all in. Okay. So after you do the pencil, it's not a big, you know, notice, but it's, it's going to be a notice. So then I then take my concealer. Um, it's the Fit Me brand. Excuse me. I get the Sand. Yeah, I get the Sand 20. Um, you, one thing I had to do was I had to get so many different shades to see what my shade was. Everybody's face is different. Get what you feel that is good for your face. You may have to try two or three or three or four, but it takes time to learn your skin, your color. You know what I'm saying? So now I'm just going to outline my brows. That's all I do. Now, all I'm doing is going under and top with my brows. Okay, see what I'm doing? I'm just going over, you know, I'm going under and over my shape. That's all I'm doing, literally. Like, y'all, this stuff, makeup stuff is so easy. Like, you don't have to be a pro. Don't be watching those videos thinking like, oh, I have to make it look like this. No, it's your face. Like, you create how you want your face to be. You get what I'm saying? Like, you do. Just to use good products and use a, have a good skincare routine. Um, so your face don't, don't break out. But it's your face. Do what you want to do with it. You get what I'm saying? Like, just do what you want to do with it. You have to like get to know your face, get to know like what looks good on you. Something that I have learned about my face is that I don't really look good with um, eyeshadow. So I, you never will see me wearing eyeshadow. You know, I, that's something that I have learned about my face. I don't like eyeshadow. I like a, a clean, natural beat to my face. So we're going to do the same thing to this side. And you want to create the arch. You see how this one... I have like an arch. You want to create an arch. Don't have your eyebrows straight, okay? But it's it's your arch, whatever, how your eyebrows are arched. So go with that saying, don't create a new arch. I At least I don't. I don't create a new arch. I'm being as natural as possible. And always remember, your eyebrows are sisters, not twins, okay? It may not look the same. Okay, I got this concealer for my eyebrows at Walmart for like six bucks, okay? After I do that, um, conceal them. I take a brush. You can get a brush like this. It's a flathead brush from Walmart. The brand, this brand is e.l.f. I love e.l.f. And all you're doing is blending them, okay? You're just blending it out. So this is how I do it. It's so hard to do this on camera. This is what I do, okay? You're taking it and you're lightly. You're not going so hard right now. You know what I'm saying? You're blending that concealer out. And then I take it and I go a little bit over. And you're going to mess up a little bit. That's okay. You can go back and fix it. It's makeup. I go up here. And I blend out. But you see that line? You don't want that line. Don't be that person that has that line that you can tell. You know what I'm saying? And we're going to fix that in a second. Okay. So, I just get my concealer all the way blended out as possible. It's from Walmart. And I just blend it into my skin, basically. I take it like this and I just blend it. You see? That's all I'm doing. And I go from the top and I'm blending it out, okay?
that, I apply my foundation. Now, me, I get um, my foundation from Walmart. I get Fit Me. Um, I get matte. But lately, I have been using um, this Maybelline foundation. I get sun, uh, Warm Sun. And I usually get it um, in Fit Me too. This one is Warm Sun. Um, this one is Warm Sun too. It really doesn't matter, but it did take me a while to find my color for my face so it just depends you have to um try a few of them out so i'm gonna use my maybelline i like maybelline better than fit me um but that's just me you can use whatever you want to use and i just put it on my hand like this yeah easy makeup it may seem like it's taking a long time because i'm explaining it but when i'm just doing this super easy super fast and I just go one, two, three, probably put like four on each side, but in on my chin and a few on my forehead. And then I take this flat brush and I got a brush set from Marshalls and I take it and I just blend it all into my skin. But you have to make sure that both sides are even. So if you're gonna put three, that's on one side do that to the other that's what i do it may work for somebody and it may not and i make sure that i'm getting the foundation flat on me you know what i'm saying not one side cakier than the other or darker than the other and i get my foundation a little darker than me because that's just once I get done with it, it doesn't look this orangey, you know what I'm saying? And that was something I had to learn with my face. Learn about learn about my face. This is where it comes very important because I'm trying to blend that foundation over that so it doesn't have that line, you know, a noticeable line. You want to, I always like a little line. So you can tell, you know, they can pop out a little bit, but it's totally up to you and how you want to do things. I also come down here so it can blend in with my neck. And y'all, it don't probably even look like I have on foundation. Like when I tell you this is a natural beat, every day, not every day. I don't wear makeup every day, but when I want to go somewhere, this is what I do. <laughs> okay. So, sponges, and I just kind of dab a little bit. Take my concealer from Walmart. This is um, Glamouflage um, Concealer. And this is what I do. I just do a few lines. Don't do too much because you will look like you got baby powder on. Okay? Don't do all that. Now, this is where it gets like that at. me how i've learned like i said everybody is different what i do is i use my fingers a lot with makeup and that may work for you and it may not work for you i cannot use brushes really on my face besides my eyebrows and my foundation and contour other than that i have to use my fingers and that's the way that i that's just how i always did it and that's how i've always stuck to it so what I do is I take and I put it under my eyes and a little bit by my nose like this. White. Um, on this side, after I blend it in, it's, it's white, but it's not extremely white. You don't want that whitish look. You know what I'm saying? That noticeable look. Now, I take my contour stick. I get the stick. You can get this at Walmart or Five Below. They're like $3. And I get a little darker color because this is what I'm going to contour my face with. Bring it kind of out a little bit. So I do like a few marks, lines, right there under that white line, right in the middle of my cheek. I hit my nose and I do on my forehead, okay? Now I take one of the sponges before I take the sponge, 
I have setting powder. You can go anywhere and get setting powder. Do not get a light, light, light one. I advise everybody not to. Don't do that. I do one, two, one, two. Okay. Then under that brown line that I did, I go one, two, one, two. That's it. And I hurry up because I don't want to bake it on there so long. You know what I'm saying? This is called baking. Everybody calls this baking. And I take my little sponge and I go up with the con with the um, contour up here. I just go up with it and I blend it in. Not no extra mess going on. My hair, my hair always gets in the way. I usually put a hair net on when I'm doing my makeup, but I'm recording, so I'm not. And then. When I'm going on my cheeks, I go down. Don't go sideways. Always go down with this method. Okay? Girl, do not go sideways. Just blend it on down, okay? And then this side, do the same blend it down. Now my nose, I go down on my nose a little bit. And then I go to the sides. Because it has that white, the white mark. And I just blend that brown into my nose. So my nose ain't all white and ashy. And let me say this again. This is how I do mine. This is not a professional. This is me. This is how I do it. So please keep y'all negative opinions and comments to yourself. I take. Um, this is a contour palette. Um, it's like four bucks, five bucks at Walmart. And it is wet and wild. And it has the light and the dark. I use the dark. So I take my brush, like a fluffy brush. I take it. And that bl that brown line that we did, I just go over it with more brown. To kind of darken it up. And then... this so i just go up above where i did on my forehead and do that as well then i take the same thing this is what i do my same brush and i go over the white and i'm blending in the white with the brown okay and it, you probably can't even tell i have more makeup but that is the point, you know? I mean, you can you can tell, but it's not like a, ooh, she got too much makeup on, you know? I'm not extra. Almost done. So then I have this um, bronzer, it's a glow bronzer that I use. And I take another brush, a different brush, and I take it in that white, I go under it, I go over it. Like this. And this is from Walmart as well. Everything is pretty much from Walmart. But you can use any type of bronzer that you want to use. And then I go above on my forehead. And I'm not wearing lashes. I'm not putting my lashes on. Because I'm doing kind of like a natural beat my black liner under my eyes right here okay and it kind of gives it that pop and i'm gonna show you all close up because i don't know if the lighting is good enough then i take when i don't feel like putting the lashes When I don't feel like putting on lashes, I use um, my mascara. I do my highlight. This highlight is the best highlight. I have had this highlight for so long. It's so much in here. I, it's so good. It's by L'Oreal True Match. It's, um, it's Lummy, Lummy um, Shimmerista, I think. Yeah, and I use this. And this is how I apply my highlight. One line and then just go up. 
take it on my other cheekbone, go up. So all I'm doing, now I probably do a little bit more. And then I go one line down my nose like this. I take my e.l.f. setting spray. I love, I always use e.l.f. setting spray. And I spray my face. This is how I do my makeup. Just like this. A natural, clean beat. And it's beginner friendly. Do your makeup like this. You will love it. You do not have to be um, a professional. Don't let nobody tell you. But this is my beat. You know what I'm saying? So go ahead and do it like this. <laughs> All right, y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. This is my tutorial, how I do it. This is not a um, professional way. This is me. So y'all let me know how y'all like this video. If y'all try it out, let me know. Um, if y'all see some other products that y'all like that are better, let me know. But yes, this is my beats. I'll see y'all in the next video, period.